Hey class, um, I hope you've met Miss Freeman by now. She's your substitute today. I'm sorry I'm not there with you, but I wanted to give you a little intro video to what you're doing today. Um, you are doing a timed essay on The Great Gatsby, and your prompt is on the next slide. It's going to be given to you in just a second. I'll tell you it's more about the movie than the book. So if you were in one of my second or sixth periods and you didn't get to watch the movie a whole lot because you were working on your timeline, then just do your best. I'll tell you right now, I'm grading you more on if you can finish the essay within the time period and if you have organized it well and are doing a good job on it. Um, the actual content's not as important here, mostly because it's about a movie. So um, just know that going into it, but you're going to be timing yourself. So if somebody wants to volunteer to set a timer on their phone, that's helpful. Um, you're going to set it for 40 minutes. Actually, you're going to set it for 35. And then you're going to give everybody a five-minute warning and then set it for five more minutes. But there's going to be a timeline on the next slide, a little breakdown of what time you're going to do what for the essay. And I'd like for you to follow that as closely as you can. It's all broken down into five-minute increments. If you finish early, that's fine. But if you're over that five minutes on a certain section, you need to get caught up somewhere else. Does that make sense? This is because this is how the ACT essays are kind of set up. So this is going to be the big practice I give you for that. So um, that's what you're doing today. I um, hope you find it a little interesting. It's dealing with the music in the movie. So just get ready for that. But if you will now, just click on this um, slide right here, and it'll go to the next one where your prompt and your timeline is. Please turn this in by the end of the class. That's first, second, and fourth you're going to turn it in. For sixth period, you're probably going to have to finish it for homework because of the activity schedule. But you might have 10 minutes of homework or something if you'll just set a timer at home for 10 minutes and finish your essay. That'll be great. Um, I think that's all I've got for you today. Be awesome. I'll see you at the game tonight if you're there. Um, but have a good time at the pep rally. Wind out the Wildcats and all that jazz. So, see y'all later.